Meghan Markle has suffered from a number of terrible issues since joining the royal family, with negative press surrounding Kate being nothing like that of the Duchess of Sussex. Meghan Markle has been subject to terrible problems throughout her role as the Duchess of Sussex, the royal expert said. Melody Bromley also suggested public scrutiny surrounding Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge, was nothing like that of Meghan. Speaking on E! News, Ms Bromley revealed, but Kate didn't have this. Even Kate who, she had longer to prepare, any negative press she got was like, oh her mother worked for an airline, whatever it was, or Kate's uncle was a bit controversial with his maze on the bang bang in a visa. But it was nothing like this, what Meghan's had to deal with as far as her father against her, her sister and her half-brother, has been terrible. Guest Aaron Lim agreed. Yeah she has everything stacked against her. Ms Bromley also discussed how Meghan is on track to receiving the same treatment Princess Diana received in the early days of her marriage to Prince Charles. She said, while it was great at first, it looks great on the outside, becoming a duchess, becoming a princess, but it's horrific. It's a gilded cage and now she's under so much negative attention and there's nothing she can do about it. This is what Diana went through. Honestly. The similarities between what she's going through and what Diana went through initially, before Diana became a saint in the press. The comments follow rumors of a rift between the two duchesses, as Meghan and Prince Harry announced they were moving out of their Kensington Palace home on the royal estate shared with Kate and William, and into Frogmore Cottage located 25 miles away. This came after reports Kate had been left in tears after her daughter was fitted for her bridesmaid dress for Meghan's wedding in May. Harry was said to have been angered with brother Prince William for not rolling out the red carpet for Meghan. Meghan was also reported to have angered the Queen after she asked for air fresheners to rid St. George's Chapel of an apparent musky smell before her wedding. She reportedly also demanded the emerald tiara Princess Eugenie had secured for her own wedding at the same venue last October. Three of Meghan and Harry's aides have quit their roles months into having Meghan as their boss. Despite the bombardment, Meghan has kept smiling while on official outings with her husband. She was even pictured chatting happily with the Duchess of Cambridge when the royal family attended a church service on Christmas Day.